Nandi Ndaitwa encouraged beneficiaries to create jobs, especially for the youth. She says the young people are the future of Africa and they need to be well taken care of. The Deputy Prime Minister stated that people must focus on nation building and economic transformation to ensure quality services and create a better life for all. She added that without substantial and skilled human capital, Namibia cannot be productive now and in the future and urged the leadership of the town to equip the youth with the needed skills to succeed. Having liberated ourselves from the apartheid regime of South Africa, a system that had no regard of our people, it's now time for us to ensure that our people who have been denied quality things such as quality education and economic prosperity are being supported. Omaruru Mayor Vincent Kahwa called on the beneficiaries to put donated equipment to good use. This is a happy day for me. The reason being, we are going to receive equipment for a good purpose. We know we have a challenge of unemployment. The rate of Amaruru in terms of unemployment is about 70%. Only 30% are employed. The beneficiaries have been cautioned against selling the equipment and materials. I will personally go and visit those projects that we are giving today. I will make sure that if you are not using it, read my lips. We are going to take over the equipment from you and give it to the next beneficiary. And this is what one of the beneficiaries had to say. I am fighting so hard to feed my family. My age is not even close to getting a pension. And when people smile end of the month, I don't. For that reason, I became a small-scale miner. And from that money I get, I feed my household. Goresses employs 10 people. 